I'm less than his wife, Melanie. <laughs> Melanie. <laughs> she is really great with children. My stomach keeps making weird noises. Can the microphone hear it? I don't know. It's from what we ate. Hi. More story fandom. Food never agrees with me. <laughs> food doesn't agree with you? That food doesn't agree with me. It was your idea. Because your idea was somewhere that was closed. <sighs> We're here <laughs> with uh, another reaction to Randy Rainbow. This one is a very stable genius requested by Carolyn I think. The YouTube name. Mm -hmm. Well, it's right? I don't know. I don't know. You just said the first name. You want to start over? <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I don't know. It's like the YouTube name thing. Anyway, so we're here to watch this video. Um, before we get started, though, we'd like to do a really quick reminder. We are still doing the subscriber drive. I'm not going to do it when he expects it. <laughs> Which, subscriber, what are subscriber drive. drive. God damn it. <laughs> wondering what that is. Basically, that's poop cookies. Aesop's Fibbles by Brandy. It's poop cookies. Aesop's Fibbles by Brandy. It's poop cookies. It teaches you a lot. Just like Aesop's. It teaches you that poop cookies are gross. No, it teaches you very important life lessons. Anyway, that's <laughs> piqued your curiosity at all. Well, we're Piked. Trying... Peaked. Piqued your curiosity. Piked. <laughs> it piqued your curiosity, folks. Took your curiosity, chopped its head off, and put it on a pike. Pike. It's a peep dream. <laughs> it piked your curiosity. Now I'm just going to keep switching up. The I and the E so in every <laughs> word I say. <laughs> if it piqued your curiosity, <laughs> you're gonna have to subscribe to find out why. When we do new subscribers, we'll tell you about. Subscribed. <laughs> we'll tell you about. Fry of cookies. charge. <laughs> and free of charge. Fry of charge. <laughs> we'll include the sequel, Poop Cookies 2. Drop and trial. Fry of charge. <laughs> In the meantime, Fry of charge. let's get to this. More Randy Rainbow, a very stable genius. Genius. <laughs> genius. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just go ahead. Oh, since it's genius, it would be genius. 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 It's funny, they don't have their headphones in yet. We're about to start. Well, we're trying to. Uh, no, but the, but the I is oh, an yeah. E sound. Genius. Yeah, you're right. It's not like an alien vagina. Because it's genius. Yeah. Genius. Okay. So genius. Genius. Or like a gynecologist for an alien. A viri. Viri stable. <laughs> genius. Let's just, let's just gonna go ahead and go click. As you know, I'm meeting with President Putin on Monday. And we will, of course, ask your favorite question about meddling. I will be asking that question again. You know, what am I going to do? If he may deny it. I mean, it's one of those things. So all I can do is say, did you, and uh, don't do it again. But he may deny it. I mean, well, uh, you'll be the first to know. I'm very consistent. I'm a very stable genius. We still have to figure out what's going on with he is the very model of a very stable genius. Of all the U.S. presidents, he is the Mussolini. He learned a lot of things according to his Wikipedia and demonstrates his ample intellect on social media. <laughs> when people are in need, he is the best at making fun of them. He knows 11 words, although he can't spell even one of them. An overly flamboyant orange autocratic scuzzy man who's undermining everything Obama did because he can't. He's undermining everything Obama did because he can't. He's undermining everything Obama did because he can't. He's overly flamboyant and an autocratic scuzzy orange man. He's 
firmly resolute, but how he thinks and feels and talks depends on any of the crap he may have heard that day on Fox and Friends. And though his brain is smaller than his tiny little penis, he is the very model of a very stable genius. Although his brain is smaller than his tiny little penis, he is the very model of a very stable genius. I am doing a great job, that I can tell you. He's very good at pushing all the bullshit that he's peddling, but won't concern himself with matters such as Russian meddling. His campaign manager's in jail on charges that are felony, and no one really cares about him less than his wife, Melanie. <laughs> Melanie. <laughs> he is really great with children when it comes to immigration. He thinks he's making progress with denuclearization. He's only hated from Seattle to the Carolinas and likes to greet his lady friends by grabbing their vaginas. He likes to greet his lady friends by grabbing their vaginas. He likes to greet his lady friends by grabbing their vaginas. He likes to greet his lady friends by grabbing their vaginas. He likes to greet his lady friends by grabbing their vaginas. Queen Elizabeth did not see that coming. He's certainly proficient at hijacking an election. And Edo, he is not afraid of not taking direction. Aside from all his ignorance, the chaos and subpenius, he is the very model of a very stable genius. I would say the highest level of special. He's always been a pro at things like violating protocols and reproducing other egotistical Neanderthals. To all our greatest allies, he decides to say, get out of here while doing all he can to satisfy his daddy, Vladimir. There's no one as accomplished in the art of the distraction. Of anything that's factual, he orders a retraction. When greeting foreign leaders, he prefers the pomp and circumstance than vomits verbal diarrhea to satisfy his sycophants. There never was a military draft he couldn't dodge, and he is excellent at advocating racist and misogyny. He likes to make up stories with convenient exclusion of topics that he finds make him feel threatened like collusion. He expertly persuades his base that Mueller's hunting for a witch. Instead of their own president, who's obviously Putin's bitch, he calls reporters fake and says the Democrats are sour grapes, then lies awake at night and thinks about those Russian pee-pee tapes. He lies awake at night and thinks Oh, never has the sinister stable genius the smartest he And if you don't believe me, you can just ask Sarah Huckabee And though his brain is smaller than his tiny little penis He is the very model of a very stable genius very stable genius Whatever, girl <laughs> I'm asking no? you to make a donation. Okay. Don't worry, we hate him too, but this, this is not the time for your ad. That song was longer than I remember. <laughs> I, I actually knew that one. I am forever going to say Peneus. <laughs> Look at the bright side. I actually knew that one. That's true. From a video game, but I knew it. Oh my god! What? It had the aliens singing in Mass Effect. Oh my god! Very model of a Solarian scientist. Never mind that they sing it on Big Bang Theory, but it's cool. Yeah, yeah, Mass cares. Effect. Mass Effect. N seven. I'm gonna forever say penis. <laughs> God. We have such a douchebag in office. Ugh, don't we know it. I pay more in taxes than he does. I know. I'm not even working. We I tweeted that out on the account. I tweeted out that we paid more in property taxes for our little yeah, old that, house alone. Yeah, that's the thing that just... like broke tonight was the whole tax thing. Especially because like so we pay more in taxes. He does, period. We pay more on this house alone. How big is the Mar-a-Lago? How does he not pay property taxes in the millions on that place? That's because for 10 of those years, he, he said that he lost money and didn't make money. But Which I believe. he's a self-made billionaire. Well, that I don't believe. That's bullshit. But I believe he did, because this is the only man I can think of who's owned multiple casinos and had them go bankrupt. Casinos. Doesn't the house always win? No, it doesn't, Trump. Oh. I'm hoping he's watching this for some reason, okay? As long as I don't tweet it out, he might. Well, I'll tweet it out. <laughs> At Orange Douchebag. That should be his Twitter handle. Not real Donald Trump. Anyway, Julius. That was. <laughs> I thought it was funny. Yeah. We all agreed that you sound like a chipmunk. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, did he inhale helium? 
<laughs> no, that's his natural voice. When they don't slow him down for TV. God, I hate him. Yeah. I don't think I've ever really hated people. I, I find the emotion useless, but... You've made a lot of I've made it an exception. Have I? Okay. Well, I hate him the mostest. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think I've ever hated anyone. Okay, I'll, I'll put it like this. For a long time, I like to consider myself like an independent. I'll be liberally slanted, but still independent. I didn't care about parties. Nuh-uh. I voted all the blue. <laughs> this fucking election. Uh, we got our Yeah, we our literally ballots. filled out our ballots. We did that today. <laughs> and we were pretty much blue, 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 blue. No, we did research. No, no, but that, that's different. On the actual candidates, we did blue. On the judges, we sat down and we heard all the judges be like, you're corrupt, so no, you're corrupt, so yeah. no, you're not, so yes. Yeah, I'm sorry. But, that is the beauty of a mail-in <laughs> ballot is you get to sit there and actually, like... Research. Research each person. So you can find Instead out, oh, of just being like, this, I don't know. This lady is the da- daughter-in-law. This judge here is the daughter-in-law of the former corrupt sheriff of Cook County who used to work for Daly. And, you know, she has been, you know, got connections. So you usually on no. that, I'm not going to lie, usually in that section I just write no. I always fill out no. I didn't know who they were. But I'm not going to vote for you if I don't know. <laughs> that way I can't feel bad later. Well, unfortunately, <laughs> a lot of people... That's why when Rom became mayor here, like, I was like, shit, I ain't vote for him, so that's well, all you people. I used to vote for those areas. I was like, <laughs> random stuff. Yes, yes, no, no, yes, yes, no, yes, yes. What made the fucking names? Just yes, no, no randomly. Like. I always didn't know. Like, you're a politician, I'm going to vote No. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh it's you probably want, a better you policy. Keep your job? Oh, I'm go no. <laughs> but this time we researched. Mm-hmm. We voted like our lives depended on it because it does. Mm-hmm. We're looking at you people. He's like, I'm too young to vote. <laughs> He's like, I can't vote yet. <laughs> Two more years, so therefore, next election, twenty twenty four. Don't bump in. Don't bump in. <laughs> <laughs> don't vote in. You can't speak at all. <laughs> don't vote in Ivanka or Donnie don't, Jr. Don't bump them. <laughs> or I Eric don't know Barrick. what bumping is, but please don't do it. I was trying to say it vote sound, and then I to think. Gross. I couldn't remember the name of his kids for a second. So I was like, which it one is like it? It sounds like something that Ivanka? involves your penis. <laughs> so don't do it. <laughs> Anyway, if you like our content, like, comment, and subscribe. Two hundred subscribers will get you a nice, healthy dose of poop cookies. We have a Twitter. Fry of charge. <laughs> we have a Twitter that Fry of charge. I already made sure to uh, tweet out a uh, political things all the time. Subscribe, subscriber. We have a Facebook. Subscriber. <laughs> we have a Facebook. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Tweeter. We have a tweeter. You just sound like Tweety Bird now. <laughs> I thought I saw a crap bullshit at. <laughs> I lost it. I was going to say, I don't want to say bullshit ad. I thought I saw a crap bullshit asshole. <laughs> you mean bullshit? I was done in this video. <laughs>